What is going on everyone and welcome to the Stock Trends channel. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about BNGO as well as one other stock that analysts say is a strong buy. So we're going to be diving into that. Also, we have brand new fresh news, a fresh press release out from BNGO. Haven't talked about that stock in a while. Don't want to just talk about one stock in a video. I want to give people more ideas than just one stock. So that's why we're going to talk about the other stock as well. So we're going to dive into BNGO. Make sure you're jumping down below, subscribing to the channel, hitting that thumbs up button. As of right now, based on the consensus price target across top analysts over the past three months, the price target is 14.33 with 75% upside as of right now. Now, what we can also do is see that these analysts that have these price targets of $14 or higher are either four and a half stars or five star analysts. So what you can do is you can actually dive into each analyst. You can go into the stocks they've covered and you can actually see you know how they've done in the past and see their rating and see if they've had a high success rate, which many of these analysts have. Take out the grain of salt does not mean everything. Diving into the stock analysis here, BNGO right now gets a nine on the tip ranks platform in terms of analysts, tip rank investors, blogger opinions, new sentiment, which we also got some fresh news we'll talk about right now. And the technicals are setting up quite nicely at least that's what they say. Now, one thing to also note here when it comes down to the technicals, we're going to talk about that. So we talk about it here on the channel all the time because we don't want to just look at a stock and say, yeah, just buy that stock. We like to be more calculated in saying, hey, where is a good area to potentially look to buy this stock? Where would you want to limit your downside risk? Where could be some price targets for the future? If you're not necessarily a long-term investor, how do you capitalize on the largest percentage move in the shortest period of time? That's what many people are here to do. So really quick, what is the news? Right here, we have a publication that outlines potential for optical genome mapping with BioNano Sapphire system to be the foundation of a new workflow in prenatal genetic testing. They're seeing now on a consistent basis the demonstration of utility for optical genome mapping in a variety of applications. And over the last year, the CEO of BNGO has said they've seen the Sapphire system demonstrate prowess in cytogenic analysis of genetic diseases, leukemias, and solid tumors. The article does go a little bit deeper and gets a little more technical as you dive on through, but this is the fresh piece of news out here this morning. So we want to dive over to Webull and see that this came out and BNGO got some attention but pulled back. So it popped up to here at 8 14, the pre-market hours and pulled back at least when we're filming this video. But what's more important, I think, to note here for BNGO is that those price targets to the upside, you know, $14, $15 price targets that the analysts have set out as of right now puts you in this range all the way up here, back up towards the highs we saw back in February. So based on the chart, is this possible? What are we looking at as support as of right now? So it looks like we saw the past couple of weeks, a pretty substantial dip down here to under $6 that we saw March 5th. And then ever since then, we did pull back and we found support down around 688, I would say down towards $7. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to draw a line, a horizontal line here at seven bucks, because that seems like that's going to be an area of support for BNGO as of right now. Also lines up quite well with an area of resistance in the past. If you go back to January, early January, that was an area of resistance. BNGO pulled back and then pushed up from there, has come down to that level a couple of times and held up pretty well. So if you're looking at a risk reward or a trade idea, what we can see as of right now, and of course on this channel, there's no hype. It's literally going over the charts, what's in front of us, the recent news, and then the technicals. So you can identify if you want to take a trade or not, if you want to buy a stock or not, it's up to you to ultimately do. No one is going to click that button for you. And if you win or lose, it is not anyone's fault, but your own because of the decisions that you made. So that's the name of the game here when it comes to BNGO. So really quick, this stock could come down to seven bucks. If it does, you can see that area holding up as it was a prior area of support. So it's sitting here just over eight. So what does that give you? About a dollar downside. Now, if you're looking for price targets to the upside, where do we find resistance back a few weeks ago? We found resistance up in the upper nines, up towards $10. So we can draw a line right there towards the top of these candles, which puts you at like 962. So if you're looking at a risk reward basis as of right now, what do you see? You see right now you're looking at a potential 13% downside with to that first resistance point upside about 17%. Now, if we do break through that resistance, the stock can go a lot higher, obviously. So if you're planning on taking this trade or you're planning on buying BNGO for a trade idea, or obviously a long-term investment's a different story. We know how ARK Invest is bullish on genomics and we know that this is going to be around for quite some time. So ultimately it's going to be down to can BNGO actually as a company 
get their stuff together and keep themselves together because they have some experience in the past of not managing their cash too, too well. But that aside, at least as of right now, this isn't a terrible trade idea, right? You have obviously more upside than downside based on this right here. And if you cut your stock and if you cut yourself for a loss, you're going to lose $1. If you look for a gain, maybe you take half of your shares off here at this 950 and then you ride the rest up until BNG maybe comes back down to your average and then you cut the rest off at your average so that you've locked in at least half of your gains and it was still a profitable trade. So that could be a decent trade idea here for BNGO. So hopefully that makes sense. Now let's dive into the next stock analysts also agree is a strong buy as of right now. And that stock is Roblox. We actually talked about Roblox a while back. It's a recent IPO, but what do we see here for Roblox? Analysts have right now a 13% upside a strong buy price target here of over $80. Now we look at all the analysts, what we can do is we can sort this by top analyst right here so we can go three stars or better, but these three star or better analysts all have price targets here of $78 or higher for Roblox, which is at least 10% higher than the current stock price. So right now, a lot of these actually came out as of yesterday. So you're looking at even as of yesterday, you're looking at some big names, Goldman Sachs, Morgan Stanley. So these are some significant names here for Roblox. And take a look at the stock analysis as of right now, they're giving it an eight, which is an outperform here on the tip ranks smart score scale. And diving into the chart, yeah, we've seen some significant volatility the past couple of days, ever since the IPO, right? We were starting out here at 60 bucks, hitting highs up over 79. We did pull back down towards 60 and now we're sitting here at 70. So if you're looking at Roblox and you're looking at this stock and you're thinking, okay, it's going to be easy money where it's going to go straight on up, please, please, please understand you're going to see some volatility. So it looks like as of right now, you have a range from about 60 to 80 bucks. If you can buy this thing under 70 down towards the bottom half of that range, that seems like a much better buy, at least as of right now, based on the price action we have seen for Roblox so far. Now, if you are not very familiar with Roblox, here's a website right now. It's actually kind of cool. It, we actually did a video. We dive a little bit deeper into a lot of the numbers behind Roblox. So go back on the channel. When the IPO came out, we dove deeper into what they do, into the numbers behind their user base, their growth as of late this past year, and what to potentially expect going forward. So we dive deeper in that video. It could be a really good video to check out if you are interested in diving deeper into Roblox. So with that said, hopefully this video was helpful in some way. If you guys want to get access to the tip ranks platform right here. Tons of research tools. You can dive through analysts. You can dive through the hot stocks, trending stocks, and you can even see things like insider buys, insider sells. Very useful stuff. We use it here on the channel all the time. There'll be a link down below to get access to this platform. Also, today is the last day of their 20% off sale. The first link in the description will be to the ultimate platform, which gets you 20% off the platform. Also, link down below to get two free stocks with Webull, the platform we use to trade every single day, trading hours from 4 a.m. Eastern all the way to 8 p.m. Eastern, so you can take advantage of the full pre-market and the full after hours trading beyond the normal market hours that many brokers will only allow. And outside of that, if you guys have not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you're doing so. Subscribe over to the personal channel. We're posting there pretty much daily as well. Hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to hit the thumbs up button and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.